Clinton's kickoff speaking tour with countless empty seats. Former President Bill Clinton and his wife, former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, began their 13-city paid speaking tour in Canada on Tuesday, where they spoke to a half-empty arena, according to the UK. Daily Mail The first evening with the Clintons as it was called, took place in the Scotiabank Arena in Toronto, where the couple was interviewed by a Canadian politician and diplomat. The Daily Mail reported that there were empty seats in both the upper and lower level of the centre and that, in the final minutes before the event, one ticket was selling on StubHub for $6.55 Canadian, which is less than $5 US. Event officials told the Daily Mail that the organizers were expecting about 3,300 people, with about 1,000 buying the more expensive tickets for lower-level seats. The event was promoted by Live Nation as a one-of-a-kind conversations with the two leaders as they tell their stories from some of the most impactful moments in modern history. Potential ticket buyers were told that the event will feature joint on-stage conversations with the two leaders sharing stories and inspiring anecdotes that shaped their historic careers in public service, while also discussing issues of the day and looking towards the future. The Clintons, who remain a source of controversy even off the campaign trail, were seated in upholstered chairs on stage under low lighting, where they were interviewed by politician and diplomat Frank McKenna the deputy chairman of the TD Bank Group, the Daily Mail reported. McKenna, who was formerly the Canadian ambassador to the US, was also a major Clinton Foundation donor, according to the Daily Wire. During the interview, the couple touched on hot topics.